Like any ecosystem, the Berry Works has everything an animal could need. Shelter, sustenance, love. It's why Big Apple City is home to such a variety of animals. One such animal is Strawberry Shortcake's cat, Custard. Custard, I'm out of rainbow sprinkles. Can you go find a bag? There's a special pet safe cupcake for you if you do. Not wanting to disappoint Strawberry, Custard embarks on her quest. However, in nature, all quests have challenges and dangers. <laughs> Not actual danger, of course. Orange Blossom's puppy, Pupcake, would just prefer fun to sprinkles. Ever loyal Pupcake vows to help Custard. But where will they find what they so desperately need? Clever Pupcake realizes Blueberry Muffin's pet mouse, Cheesecake, should be able to help. Sadly, the Dreamery Creamery is a dead end. But then, Lime Chiffon Sharp-Eyed Parrot Parfait has seen his friends and is eager to help. A possibility presents itself. Oh, so close and yet so far. Could Lemon Meringue's enigmatic frog Frappe be the final piece of this pet puzzle? And success! Now, all that is left is for Custard to deliver the prize. I did promise a pet safe cupcake for helping out. Ah, popsicle sticks, all out of icing. A pet's job is never done. There is always another challenge, another mission, another ingredient needed for this recipe called life. a very important cupcake order. Huh? Uh, not now, Custard. I have to finish this special order before tomorrow. It needs to be perfect. Forgot what? This way! Huh. Strawberry. Uh -uh. Forgot. Custard! Earth Day! <laughs> Custard has her own Earth Day? Uh, there's only one Earth Day. Every day should be Earth Day. <laughs> birthday! <gasps> Strawberry forgot Custard's birthday! Oh! Ah, what's up? You forgot Custard's birthday. 
birthday. I did what now? Are we talking about this birthday? The one that's tomorrow? Huh? Uh -uh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Didn't you notice me say these needed to be perfect? Or what the main ingredient was in this important cupcake order? <laughs> Lemon! That's cat food! Meh. Mmm, crunchy. <laughs> I was going to throw a surprise party tomorrow, but since every berry and every pet is here now, I guess we get to have the party a day early. <laughs> Happy birthday, Custard! Happy birthday! <laughs> critic for the Big Apple City Galette. A review from her can make or break a berry's baking career. I'm gonna have to pull out all the pops on this one. See what I did there? <laughs> Cake pops, because, yeah. All right, Custer, we are as baked and ready as we'll ever be for Genoise La Creme. I wonder what she looks like. Hey, girl! Excited for Genoise La Creme? Sure am! Since you're new, we just wanted to make sure you're ready. We did? Ugh. I thought you two would love nothing more than for me to fail and have to lug my truck back to Berryville with my sfoglia tele between my legs. See what I did there? Sfoglia tele? Tail? No? Anyway, we have our differences, but the more good reviews we can get from Genoise, the better it'll be for every berry at the Fairy Works. Well, then thanks. Okay, then I'm going to keep an eye out for Genoise. <gasps> uh huh. That short buttercream colored hair, obnoxiously bright floral print shirt. That's not what she. Right! And her hideous, wide-brimmed hat. Whoa! Yeah, that is not how I picture Jen was at all. But I guess you can't judge a berry by their career-ending critical commentary. Thank you! <laughs> I, uh... Hello there! I'm Strawberry Shortcake. Well, hey, sugar! I'm... I know who you are. <laughs> Allow me to sweep you off your sweets. Cake Pop? I can't believe she fell for it. While Strawberry woos that random grandma, I'll get the real Genoise La Creme to myself. Oh, there she is. Head sugar cake my day. <laughs> oh, today was just the tastiest treat. <laughs> you sure know how to bake some berry feel special strawberry shortcake. Oh, you stop it. <laughs> Be sure to share those cupcakes with your cranberries. Ooh, rough day. To put it mildly. Well, I bet it is nothing a cake pop can't make better. Here you go, on the house. Genoise La Creme? <laughs> I should have known. <laughs> At the Berry Works, the cake pop is king. Or should I say queen? The sugary purveyor of the extraordinary berry not only makes a divine dessert, but refreshingly treats all of her guests from food critics to out-of-town grandmas like VIPs. Two crumbs way up. Woo! Not bad for a day's work, Strawberry. <laughs> <laughs> There, there. Ah! Oh. oh, yeah. Oh, ho. Strawberry shortcake and her dressy sous chef custard. Custard? 
when I'm hungry, too. I was busy and Custard wandered off, and now I can't find her, which makes me a terrible person. And an even worse cat, Mom. Popcake always disappears. I think he does laps around the building. I'm pretty sure Parfait eavesdrops. Frappe takes off all the time. You know, when I get too chatty. Sup? Cheesecake runs an underground poker game for other animals. She counts the cards. Blueberry Muffin is very creative with her facts. She makes them up. None of you know where your pets are? Shortcakes! Hey, 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 hey. Don't worry, Shortcakes. We'll work together to find all the pets. Thanks. I've studied every inch of the Berry Works. I'll lead the pet rescue. Do we really think the pets wandered in here? Where is here? These are the original storage rooms. It's fascinating, actually. <laughs> Constructed when this was all apple trees, the Big Apple Berry Works led to the small town of Apple Grove becoming Big Apple City. And the apple trees were planted by a magical berry guardian who sprinkled enchanted seeds from high above the clouds. True story. Not true. Custard? Oh, phew! It's just a painting of Jay Quincy and his wife Henrietta Cupcake. History says her recipes inspired Jay Quincy to start his cupcake factory. Of course, it was the flock of Tutti Fruity Toucans who flew down from the Forbidden Fruitlands that inspired Henrietta. Again, not true. Tutti Fruity Toucans are not an actual breed of bird. That's true. Except in the Forbidden Fruitlands. The Forbidden Fruitlands are not a thing. Okay, okay, I think we should just focus back on what's important here. Yeah, like why is that whisk upside down? Jay Quincy said great recipes start with whisking. Legends say his whisk was magical and led to his success. That's why he hid it in a secret room and... No, I've researched the berry works for years. No berry guardians, no toucans, no magic whisk, and definitely no secret room. Legends say... History says... All right, all right, enough with the history and the legends. We're here to find the pets, not to talk about why the Berry Works was built, where the secret room is, or why this whisk is upside down. those toucans? Well, legends say that Tutti Fruity toucans can grow as big as airplanes. And they only eat grapes. They don't like anything else. It's really delicious. Chocolate and rum raisin? Been done. Pineapple and grass. Too sour. Coming up with unique ice cream flavors isn't easy. You have to clear your mind and let the universe guide you to something truly tastastic. Caramel and relish. Ugh. Some days the universe isn't very helpful. Hmm, I'll try this and this and this. Too many flavors. So cold. Rain is frozen. Okay, Blueberry, I've got a butter cake that needs a little something extra. And that something extra is ice cream! I mean, it's a vanilla butter cake, and the only ice cream flavor I can think of to go with it is vanilla. But I mean, come on! Vanilla on vanilla is just so obvious. And I don't want to be obvious, so I do not want vanilla. What flavor do I want? You're the expert, what should I do? Vanilla. 
Right. That's what I don't want. <laughs> Blueberry, are you okay? <gasps> Cheesecake! Blueberry's frozen! No, not just frozen! She's got brain freeze! Why didn't you tell me? Blueberry is usually so creative, she comes up with flavors no berry would think of. But not if she's got brain freeze. I have got to unfreeze her so she can get back to brainstorming brilliant ice cream for me. I mean herself. to thaw her out. At least we can snack while we wait. Marshmallow and cheese. Yeesh! <laughs> that is an interesting combo. I mean, Blueberry would love it if she ever snaps out of this whole frozen thing. If the campfire doesn't work, I'm not uh -huh. sure what we'll do. Maybe, maybe some sort of sauna or... No. Oh, maybe some hot peppers. Yeah, that could... Ow! It's not about warming up her body. It's about warming up her creativity with something weird, wacky. <gasps> this sweet, cheesy, smoky combo should do the trick. Cheesecake, why didn't you think of this? Humph. Tapioca, I love it! Marshmallows, cheese, and smoke. The perfect pairing of sweet and savory. I'll call it Camembert Campfire. Crunch. Yeah! Woo! My butter cake is saved! <laughs> huh. Camembert Campfire Crunch. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah! Oh, my taste buds! So, yeah, I went with vanilla on vanilla. No! Hot cross buns! This is horrible! What's with all the yelling? I set them out to cool, and look! I even put a sign out, hot pies, only eat when cool. But no, some berry decides to come along and gobble them up. This really bakes my bread, you know? Who would do such a horrible thing? Oh, I can find the culprit. Yes! Lime is an awesome detective. Is that a donut? Crack a clue, take a bite. I've read a lot of Apricot Christie mysteries. I know all the tricks to find the who, what, where, when, and hi. Also, I really like donuts. I don't think there are many clues to go on. It's all just a mess. Yes, this crime scene is a mess. No berry would eat pie like this. We are clearly looking for an animal. An animal? <gasps> This cat's paws don't match the markings in your pies. Therefore, she is innocent. Ha. Wow, you are good. Oh, I'm just getting started. Red Hot the Ferret, our next suspect. He is? What do you know about it? Ferret. Get out of town. Red Hot would never steal from a baker as sweet and generous as Strawberry. Aww. Thank you, Huck. Besides, he's been with me all day. Uh, hey, let us help. Leave no bag of flour unturned, no critter unquestioned, no pie left behind. I was at a 
a dead end. I checked every animal, followed every lead, but I had nothing. Are you narrating right now? Here, Huck, you can have the last bite. I don't deserve it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> hey, it's okay, Lime. You tried your best. I'll just have to keep a closer eye on... Huckleberry Pie did it. <gasps> I would never. You ate my donut like an animal. Just like the pies. Why would I steal from Strawberry? She gives me pies for free. Um, say what now? Her sign said, hot pies only eat when cool. Strawberry likes my music. She thinks I'm cool. So she leaves those pies out for me. That's not what the sign means, is it? No not even a way. little. Wow. I stole the pies, didn't I? Uh -huh. Yeah, totally. Just wow. Oh, I'm sorry, Strawberry. I really did think those were thank you pies for my smooth and jazzy tunes. I do think you're cool, and your tunes are very smooth and jazzy. <laughs> Just check with me next time. There's still one mystery left. Why do you eat pies like that? Big Apple Fair's pie eating champion, three years in a row. No better way to enjoy a pie. Okay, fairies, on your mark. Get set. Go! Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Pies do taste better this way. Another mystery? So. Animal. <laughs> the best thing about living in Big Apple City is there's always something amazing happening. Like today, the Berry Works is holding a golden berry challenge. Yeah, I have no idea what it is, but it sounds cool, and I am going to win. Let's it up. Every, Every berry, berry touches the golden berry. berry. If you break contact for any reason, you're out. Whoever is left touching it at the end wins the secret prize hidden inside. Three, two, one, go! It's just us now. We are awesome! Ready to give up? Never! Hey, what do you think is inside of this anyway? Oh, an endless supply of books. <laughs> I'm gonna need more bookmarks. Books? No way. It's a Slicer ZX Kibisaki dirt bike. Sorry, there is no way a kiwisaki fits inside that berry. No one does, though. Spark berries. Enough spark berries to fuel my greatest invention, the machine machine. A machine that makes smaller machines. <laughs> What do the smaller machines do? I will get back to you on that. I bet the prize is a perfect song. So, there's like a speaker inside. No, just a song. It will play once, then disappear. Forever. That's an interesting theory. What do you think, Strawberry? <gasps> No, no, no. Chocolate chips? No! Sprinkle chips. Woohoo! <laughs> or coconut flakes with a pinch of... Uh, strawberry? Aw, fiddle faddle! Ah! <gasps> <laughs> 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 so I guess that means blueberries the winner? Uh-huh. This pigeon is so interesting. Uh, with no clear winner, I think the prize goes to... The MC! Actually, I think he's the winner. Frappe was stuck there the entire time? I cannot believe we didn't notice that. You 
did say whoever was left touching it at the end was the winner. Ugh, fine. The frog is the winner. Ooh, let's see what's inside. It's a gift card to Guava Spava. That's really so boring. Nice? A gift card might not be what we had our hearts set on, but maybe it's exactly what Frappe wanted. What would a frog possibly want with a gift card to a spa? It's fitting we're here at the Cuban Time Museum of Modern Art. Let's see how our bakers did. I love Bite of the City. Kiki Key Lime goes all over Big Apple City finding the best bakers. Could there be a more perfect show for me? As these cupcakes show, today's contestants proved a great baker needs to be a great artist as well. Yes, exactly. <laughs> you so get me, Kiki. Do you have what it takes to be the very best in baking? Oh, I do. Then I can't wait to come to your neighborhood and take a bite of the city. <sighs> Hello? Is there a baker in there? Yes, Kiki Key Lime. There really is. Behind you, actually. <gasps> I'm just imagine this and you're there. And it's just you're my favorite person. And I love you lots. <laughs> I get that a lot. Hi, I'm in a rush to my next shoot, but I do need a quick bite. What have you got? Okay, okay, I can do this. I can totally do this. Don't freak out. Just take a deep breath. <gasps> Today, I am serving Lady Fingers. My cranberry jam taught me how to... Oh, I love Lady Fingers, but I'm wondering if you could add some organic hand-pressed key lime juice. And you know what I love? A hint of Costa Rican coffee where the beans have been sung to. They just have that extra oomph, you know? Also, could you throw on just a dollop of mascarpone cheese? If you can't, it's totally fine, but if you can, that would be more fine. Just need to grab some ingredients. It should take me. I have two minutes and 36 seconds. Custard, you're in charge. Orange, tell me you have key limes, please. Nope, just regular limes today. Can you juice it for me? Sure thing. Hand juice it, please. Okay. Mm You're the best, I owe you a cake! Sometimes it's easier not to ask. Lemon, lime! Do you have Costa Rican beans that have been sung to? Why would I sing to coffee beans? There's no time for crazy questions! Seriously, who sings to beans? Every berry knows you read to them. It was the best of beans. It was the worst of beans. No time! Lemon beans! Oh, hot music! The best things in life. That'll do it! I owe you all five! That was weird, right? Blueberry! No need. The universe has spoken. Mascarpone ice cream awaits. But how did you... Shh. You must go. I owe you some cookies. <laughs> Lucky Spoon, don't fail me now. Constructed tiramisu, delicious. That hit the spot. Extraordinary berry, huh? I'll remember that. Bye. Did you hear that, Custard? She'll remember that we did it. Now we can just relax and bask in the glow of this fantastic moment. Ahem. <laughs> Aren't you? We're getting something. Pies. That something is pies. Right after I bake those thank you desserts. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I can't be sick. There's no time. I need 500 cupcakes for Sweetie Pie Preschool's annual bake sale, baked and ready by five o'clock today. 
sorry. Wow, you look terrible. You should really go rest. I can't. I need to get these cupcakes done. It's for the kids. <gasps> How about we help with the baking? Every berry needs some berry sometimes, shortcakes. I don't know if that's the best. Huh? <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> oh. Okay, fine. Orange, you're gonna weigh out the dry ingredients here. Lemon, you stand here and combine the wet ingredients, and then we're gonna pass it to Blueberry. Wow, you really captured my aura. Uh, don't worry. We got this. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go rest of the clubhouse. Text me if you need anything. And don't forget, an extra large egg is better than a regular large egg. All right, girls. Let's make our sweet, but very easily stressed out friend proud. Let's yeah. do this. <gasps> it's like looking in a mirror. Blueberry, focus. Did you hear that? It said my name. Hmm, if I use the best methods from each book, I'll make perfect cupcakes. Butter must be super cold, got it? <gasps> huh? Wait, this says room temperature butter is best. Which is it? Wait! <laughs> <sighs> no recipes, no rules. Just me and Egg Sheeran. Vibing. Five cups of sugar? That's unhealthy. How about no cups of sugar? <gasps> and maybe some powdered veggies to add some nutrients. <laughs> Yum! So healthy. Thanks, Custard, but I am not tired, so... That's it. Never leave home without my super duper piping bag 3000. <sighs> I feel so much better, Custard. You know what? It is so nice to have friends who can be there for you and keep you calm, keep you relaxed, keep you freaking out! What did you do? I'm calling it the unbearable icing of being. Ugh. I never made it past the butter. Oh no, I have to deliver 500 cupcakes uh, now, and nothing is done! Sorry, shortcakes. We tried, but we're just not the bakers you are. But how did this happen? You each did something totally different. You did whatever you wanted without any kind of... Wait a minute. That's it? You guys are geniuses! We are. Is she still hallucinating? <laughs> Looks like my build your own cupcake stand is a hit! And honestly, I never would have come up with the idea if you all hadn't messed up so badly. Thank you for being such terrible bakers! And for helping when I needed it. Anytime. <gasps> Lemon, no! <laughs> <laughs> I meant to do that. This may be the best cupcake recipe in the history of the universe. It's just missing one super special ingredient. <laughs> right, Lucky Spoon? Right you are, Strawberry. And that ingredient is... I dreamed the very best cupcake recipe. It had this perfect ingredient. It was, um, it, it, wa it, it was the, hold on, I know this, it, no, I can't remember what it is. Why can't I remember what it is? Come on, strawberry, it can't be that hard. Think, think, think. Uh, shortcakes? You okay? No, I came up with the cupcake recipe of my dreams, in my dreams. But I can't remember the last ingredient. Ooh, I've got just the thing. My Dream Grubber 3000. This baby uses cosmic wave to absorb all of your nighty nighttime thoughts. <laughs> kind of fair. <laughs> eh, it's still in beta testing. This is just like issue 37 of Terrific Tales of Tangerine Smash. 
Tangerine Smash was trapped in the dream world by her arch enemy, Night Mangle, and couldn't remember how to escape. <gasps> Just like me. How did she remember? Her sidekick, Guava Girl's utility belt, gets them out of any jam. Well, a utility belt isn't gonna help with this mental jam. Ow! Lemon! I'm not wearing the helmet! Why am I getting shocked? Huh, is that a bug? Or a feature? A mystery requires a detective skills. Inspector Sherbet Cones always retraces his steps. What did you do yesterday? I mean, nothing out of the ordinary. I woke up, cleaned my room. <coughs> then I had breakfast. I think it was toast with jam. Ow! Lemon! Oh, this thing is stronger than I thought. What else did you do? Typical day. Hmm. I can help you out. You can? Sure. Follow me. To remember your dream, you need sleep. To sleep, you need to be zen. To be zen, you need to meditate. Uh, uh, um, Strawberry, what are you doing? Seeing if any ingredients jog my memory. Chocolate? Peanut butter? Jam! Ow! Bean grabber, more like shock maker. Shock maker, huh? You don't happen to have a patent on that, do you? My friends were trying, but they were not helping. Seriously, not helping. If only my lucky spoon could talk, then. Chalk ah! buns! If I get one more. Wait a second. Gonna help with this mental jam. <laughs> jam. Jam! Ow! Jam! Ow! That's the ingredient! The shocks were from J-A-M! Yes! Lemon's machine worked! Oh, my friends helped after all. Well, they're gonna be the first ones to taste my dream recipe. Ow! Here you go. Try it. Oh, you're gonna love it. So, what do you think? Now that's what I call baking it happen. Good job, Strawberry. My costume is perfect. Fright Ball is all about being scary, and a scarecrow literally scares crows. <laughs> right, Custard? I overheard Raspberry Tart and the other Mean Berry saying they didn't think I would even wear a costume to the annual Fright Ball Ball. They clearly don't know this berry. Let's show these big city berries. No berry does Fright Ball like we do. Why are we the only ones dressed up? <coughs> this is my nightmare. Shortcakes, what are you wearing? It's a Fright Ball Ball. Why isn't every berry dressed up? No, this is Peach Trifle's fall ball. But Raspberry Tart said... <laughs> <laughs> nice costume. You're definitely the scariest thing at this party. <laughs> yeah, you really need to stop listening to her. What is going on over here? I'm Peach Trifle. This is my event. You are? Strawberry Shortcake. I'm a scarecrow, and this is my crow, Custard. We're dressed up for Fright Ball. Ta-da! Costumes and cheap scares aren't really what I'm known for. I throw the grandest parties in Big Apple City. Every berry loves them. No offense, but maybe your party could use some costumes and cheap scares. Excuse me? It couldn't hurt to try. The harvest moon hangs in the sky. Scarecrow scare as crows fly by. Somewhere close, a howling cry. Bright time has begun. This night feels so mysterious. Chills and thrills in store for us. Don't take it too serious. It's time to have some fun. It's a frightful night, so chill and delightful. We're in Austin, scare a friend. Thrills and chills don't have to be. A frightful night, so join in the fun. Delicious and frightacular. Tonight will be spectacular. Ooh. What creature do you want to 
be Just use your creativity And let your inner monster free and jump and scream Boom! It's kind of fun to be afraid And watch the creatures on parade Add candy and you've got it made And tricks the whole night through It's a frightful night So chill and delightful Spooky shadows everywhere Have fun, cut loose, let down your hair A frightful night So join in the fun Delicious and Shortcake Big Apple City's annual fall ball is no more. From this year forward, I shall throw the Fright Ball Frightacular! <laughs> Becoming the best baker in the world is my big dream, and big dreams need big places to come true, which is why I left my adorably tiny hometown of Berryville and came to. <laughs> hey. Oh, uh, what, what, did, what did you ask me again? If I could scoot past you. Oh, yes, right. Of course, yeah, you just... Okay. Obviously, I'm very excited to follow my dream to all new adventures in my all new home. Every aspiring baker knows that to get discovered, there's only one place to go. Big Apple City! Custard, we're here! A city that's always cooking. It's magical. It's magnificent. It's... Lady Crowded! Whoa! So many berries! Excuse me! Whoops! <laughs> Coming through! <laughs> Oopsie! Whoa! There's my favorite niece! <gasps> Aunt Praline! <laughs> aunt Praline is my super, super cool aunt. When I told her I wanted to move to the big city, she uh, said I could stay with her and she'd help get everything I need to succeed. <laughs> She's the very best! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Crab apple jam! Kiki key lime! Kill your purple vine man, no way! <gasps> the biggest names in baking all got their start right here! Sure did! And the next big name is... Strawberry Shortcake! Shortcake. I can't wait to get started! A fresh new start, a dash of nerves, a pinch of uh, 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 okay. First piece of advice, skip the heartfelt song. There's no time. Oh, uh, uh, okay. Every single day, fresh-faced berries arrive in the city. Everyone wants to be the next big thing in baking. You want to be the best? You got to be smarter, faster, focused. Keep your eye on the prize. Right, focused. Fortunately for you, your in-the-know aunt knows the inside scoop. For example, not every berry knows the first stop in the city has to be... The Berry Works! The what? The Berry Works. Obviously, it's the hottest spot in the city. It has shops, restaurants, and it's where bakers go to get discovered. It's also where my niece is going to get her start in her very own food truck. Aunt Praline, that sounds fantastic. And I'm sure that once I get settled, I'll be ready tomorrow. to... Tomorrow. Excuse me, tomorrow? Tomorrow. But, but, but I just got here. I've barely seen the city. I definitely don't have a food truck. And... Oh, trust me, you gotta just dive in. And you just let me worry about the truck. Now get some rest. Tomorrow's a big day. Love you so much. Okay. Wasn't expecting my dreams to take off quite this fast. But you, you gotta dive in, right? Yeah, okay, I'm ready. I can't wait to see this truck. What? Ta-da! My old truck, the Praline Dream! 
Ultimately, food trucks were not my jam, okay? But now you can take the truck and make your dreams come true. Well... All right, hop in, kiddo. Next stop, the Berry Works. Oh, okay, yeah, maybe it's a bit of a fixer-upper, but hey, it has character. Good luck. You're leaving? Mayor Molasses is announcing a new Sparkberry factory and he can't even find the stage without me. But you've got this. <laughs> I'm already proud. You text me later, okay? Bye. Okay, Custard, we've got this. <laughs> Woo. Yep, okay, that's not good. It really was nice of Aunt Praline to give me her old food truck to get started in Big Apple City. It's just that the truck needed a little more work than she realized. Okay, Custard, we can make this work. We just need to... Oh, um, gumdrops! What is that? Hi, my name is Strawberry Shortcake, and I... Yeah, no. I'm not doing peppy and cheerful this early in the morning. Get this thing off Berryworks property before some Berry thinks we're the city's new garbage dump. Oh, well, actually, this is my food truck. I mean, sure, it needs a bit of work, but I was gonna... Let me stop you. This is the Berryworks. It's trendy, it's chic, and it's my job to keep it that way. That pile of junk doesn't belong here, and neither do you. Whoa! This might be the worst day ever. <laughs> I can take that off your hands. Name's Lemon Meringue. I love junk, and that is some quality junk. I actually need this junk. I mean truck. It's gonna be my new bakery. Oh, so you want to be our competition. I didn't think. I don't want to be. Just play in. I love competition the way Lemon loves junk. I'm Orange Blossom. Strawberry Shortcake. Nice to meet you, Shortcakes. Let me guess. Fresh off the bus? I got here yesterday! Welcome to Big Apple City. I think you'll find most berries here are pretty friendly. I heard we have a brand new fairy! Hi, I'm Lime Chiffon. If you have any questions about, well, anything, come to me. I'm kind of an expert on, well, everything. You smell friendly. I have a good feeling about you. We all have shops here at the Berry Works. I run the Citrus Slice Smoothie Cart. Most energy-fueled smoothies in town. Blueberry Muffin runs the Dreamery Creamery Ice Cream Cart. This month's featured flavor is Raindrop Raisin Drizzle. It tastes like the forest smells right after a thunderstorm. But with raisins. That is definitely unique, yes. And Lemon Meringue and I work at the Lemon Lime Time Cart. If you ever need any... <laughs> huh? <laughs> uh, you okay? <laughs> Sorry, but Big Apple City's just been a little overwhelming. And you're all just so nice. Especially after that berry was so mean this morning. Ugh, bread pudding. Ignore him, we do. He called my truck garbage. Hmm, he's not wrong. Hmm, but it does have good energy. Adding baked goods to the mix could be good for business. If I can't take it apart, might as well put it together. Really? You'll help me? What are new berry buddies for? <laughs> this might be the best day ever. Again, I'm Strawberry Shortcake, and this is my food truck, the Extraordinary Berry. I'm new here, but I'm pretty sure this is exactly where I belong. Mm, nice color, cute name, fun garden. I suppose this will do, but I've got my eyes on you. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Scared the strawberries out of me. 
That's the idea. It's nearly Frightful. It's my first Frightful in Big Apple City. I need to come up with a creepy cupcake. I'm sure you'll come up with something frightfully fitting. <laughs> oh, if you see the ghost, say hi for me. <clears throat> I'm sorry, the what now? Blueberry, wait up! <sighs> uh, hold on. <laughs> Did you say ghost? Yep, J. Quincy Cupcake. He was the owner of the Berry Works when it was still a cupcake factory. Oh, J. Quincy was a perfectionist who checked every cupcake for the tiniest blemish. I'm gonna throw him that! Some folks say his spirit still roams the Berry Works at night. Oh, judging any baker working late. And alone. But you've never actually seen J. Quincy Cupcake's ghost, right? Huh? Oh, golly, I wish. I've tried to meet him for years. Maybe tonight you'll be the lucky berry. Have fun. Okay, a cupcake obsessed ghost. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Great, great, great. Yeah. Not creepy at all. <laughs> Strawberry shortcake is scared of ghosts. Let's give her a frightful treat she will never forget. Ooh, okay, it's fine. It's totally fine. You're just gonna grab your lucky spoon and bake. There is absolutely nothing to be scared of! Ooh, just the lights, Strawberry. It's just the lights. Stop flickering! Oh! It's just a plant. <laughs> Oh, it's a rusty sign, Strawberry. <laughs> You're just gonna, gonna get it together. <laughs> be like Blueberry, be like Blueberry, be like Blueberry. Holy hazelnuts! You're never gonna find inspiration for Scary if you're too scared to be inspired. <sighs> Calm down. All right, what's that? Bad plumbing, seriously? <laughs> oh, it is I, Jay Quincy Cupcake. Who dares bake in my present? Me? No, no baking here! It is you! Strawberry shortcake! <laughs> one time I don't want to be recognized for my baking. No one likes your gross country treats. Go back to Berryville! <laughs> <laughs> Yaha! The universe told me Strawberry was the lucky berry, and now I finally get to meet the ghost of the berry works. Put her there, Mr. Cupcake. Hey. <laughs> oh, hey. Ah. Oh, have you met Strawberry Shortcake? She's a perfectionist, just like. Huh? Hello. Well, this is the J. Quincy Cupcake. Oh, we should try one of your cupcakes. No, oh, Blueberry, they're hot. That's fine. I've got ice cream fingers, and he's a ghost. Ow! That's hot. <laughs> Gumdrops, you three are the reincarnated spirit of J. Quincy Cupcake? <sighs> I knew it. Raspberry tart? Sour grapes? Bread pudding? Why are you trying to scare me? <gasps> That's it! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! Ow. Just checking. It's my spooky surprise cake. Each bite has a new hidden flavor waiting to shock you. Raspberry, then grape, then bread pudding filling. Mmm, that is terrifyingly tasty. How did you ever come up with it? Really, Blueberry? We were together the whole time. Is it spaghetti? It's okay, Strawberry. Every berry needs to know how to get around the city on the funnel system. Luckily, you have me to teach you. It can be very complicated, so do exactly what I do and memorize everything I say. We'll start here at Rhubarb Station and take the Pineapple Express to... <gasps> Yo. Ah! Strawberry? I'm blind. Blind! <laughs> I do. I'm a lost berry. Lost little berry, what you gonna do? Lost little berry, help is gonna find you. Hey there, you okay? Hi, I'm Strawberry Shortcake. Can you and your pet rat help me? Ferret, actually. He's Red Hot, and I'm Huckleberry Pie. We play here in the funnel system for all our fans. We can probably take a break. Thank you. I have no idea how the funnel system works. <sighs> Figuring it out is easy. You just have to do it. 
But I don't know what I'm doing. What if I mess up? Just try a little something new. And I promise when you do, won't be as scary as you thought. And you'll be fine and make it through. I feel a little overwhelmed and filled with fear. Oh, you'll be fine. Not sure what I should do, it's all unclear. Just take your time. But what if I choose wrong and mess up this cute song? Well, then we'll start again, it's no big deal. Just try a little something new. Music is my passion. <gasps> like baking for me. Baking? Well, eating is my second passion. Strawberry! Lime? Lime? I found you. Did this rat hurt you? Ferret, actually. And I'm fine. Huckleberry Pie helped me. He's a musician. Actually, Huck, why don't you come with us to the Berry Works? I'm sure every berry would love your music. Uh, sorry, Strawberry. I just can't disappoint my fans down here. Right. Well, at least let me give you a thank you, Cupcake. See ya! Mm. Mm. On second thought, uh, maybe it's time for Red Hot and I to expand our musical horizons. There are more cupcakes at the Berry Works, right? <laughs> Becoming the best baker in the world is my big dream. And big dreams need big places to come true, which is why I left my adorably tiny hometown of Berryville and came to... <laughs> Hey. Oh, uh, what did, what did you ask me again? If I could scoot past you. Oh, yes, right. Of course, yeah, you just, okay. Obviously, I'm very excited to follow my dream to all new adventures in my all new home. Every aspiring baker knows that to get discovered, there's only one place to go. Big Apple City! Custard, we're here! <coughs> A city that's always cooking. It's magical. Magnificent! It's lady crowded. Oh, Whoa! So many berries. Excuse me. Whoops. <laughs> Coming through. <laughs> Oopsie. Whoa. There's my favorite niece. <gasps> Aunt Praline. <laughs> aunt Praline is my super super cool aunt. When I told her I wanted to move to the big city, she uh, said I could stay with her and she'd help get everything I need to succeed. <laughs> She's the very best. Whoa! 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 Crab apple jam! Kiki Key Lime! Peculiar purple vine and no way! <gasps> the biggest names in baking all got their start right here! Sure did! And the next big name is. Strawberry Shortcake! Shortcake. I can't wait to get started! A fresh new start, a dash of nerves, a pinch of uh, ear. Uh, okay. mm. First piece of advice skip the heartfelt song. There's no time. Oh, uh, uh, okay. Every single day, fresh-faced berries arrive in the city. Everyone wants to be the next big thing in baking. You want to be the best? You got to be smarter, faster, focused. Keep your eye on the prize. <laughs> right. Focused. Fortunately for you, your in-the-know aunt knows the inside scoop. For example, not every berry knows the first stop in the city has to be... The Berry Works! The what? 
The Berry Works. Obviously, it's the hottest spot in the city. It has shops, restaurants, and it's where bakers go to get discovered. It's also where my niece is going to get her start in her very own food truck. Aunt Praline, that sounds fantastic. And I'm sure that once I get settled, I'll be ready tomorrow. to- Tomorrow. Excuse me, tomorrow? Tomorrow. B -b -b but I just got here. I've barely seen the city. I definitely don't have a food truck and... Oh, trust me, you gotta just dive in. And you just let me worry about the truck. Now get some rest. Tomorrow's a big day. Love you so much. Okay. Wasn't expecting my dreams to take off quite this fast. But you, you gotta dive in, right? Yeah, okay, I'm ready. I can't wait to see this truck. What? Ta-da! My old truck, the Praline Dream. Ultimately, food trucks were not my jam, okay? But now you can take the truck and make your dreams come true. <laughs> well... All right, hop in, kiddo. Next stop, the Berry Works. Oh, okay, yeah, maybe it's a bit of a fixer-upper, but hey, it has character. Wow. Good luck. You're leaving? Mayor Molasses is announcing a new Sparkberry factory, and he can't even find the stage without me. But you've got this. <laughs> I'm already proud. You text me later, okay? Bye. Okay, Custard, we've got this. Yep, okay, that's not good. 